you cry, the way you smile. I am not going to be able to do it. I am not going to be Hi guys, I'm going to be teaching you how I played EXO Sing For You on the guitar. I played this song on a higher pitch because the original song was too low for my voice. So this is not exactly how they played it. So I'll start by teaching you guys the intro, the first part. Your pointer finger is on the first fret on the fourth D string. And your pinky is on the third fret on the second B string. And you plug those two strings together. And then you play the third G string that's open. And the third fret. Open again. And then strum everything down. Except don't strum the last string because it doesn't it doesn't sound good. So just strum the top strings. Second part. Your middle finger is going to be on the 3rd fret on the top 6th E string. And then your pointer finger is on the 2nd fret on the 3rd G string. And then it goes to the 3rd and 2nd again. And then the 1st E string on the 1st fret. And then you repeat this part again. On the last note, you play the third fret, first string. So. And you repeat this part again. But after that, you play the fifth fret on the first E string. And then 6th fret on the 2nd B string. For the verses, there are 4 chords that I used. I'm not sure what this is called, but I'll call it D-sharp for now since the root note is a D-sharp note. So, I'll call this D-sharp, also B-flat, G, and F. And I'll teach you guys real quick how to play those chords. So for the D-sharp, put your pointer finger in the 1st fret on the 4th D string. And then the rest of your fingers on the 3rd fret on the E, B, and G strings. B sharp and for B flat you just move all your fingers one string up that's B flat G your pointer finger is in the second fret on the fifth A string middle fingers in the third fret on the top E string your ring finger and your pinky is in the third fret on the first and second strings and for F Pointer fingers on the first fret on the top E string, and your ring finger and pinky on the third fret on the fifth A string and fourth D string. That's F. So now I'll teach you the sequence that you play the chords for the first verse. You play D sharp and B flat three times. After the third B flat, you switch quickly to G. And then D sharp again, F, and then B flat. So I played that part by switching from strumming to plucking, but it's up to you how you want to play those parts. So I started off by strumming. Just strum simply. 
just simply strumming it down. And then sometimes I pluck it. So that was plucked down the fifth A string and then switch quickly to G. It's up to you how you want to pluck that part. And then D sharp. F. I'll sing for you. B flat. And for that part, just take your pinky, slide it to the fourth fret, and slide it back. I hope that makes sense. For the second part of the verse, I plucked them, and the pattern is basically you play the root note of the chord. Pluck the, pluck the string below that, and then pluck the other two strings below together. For a B flat, the root note is the fifth A string, and then you pluck the D string below that, and then and then the second and third E and B string, you pluck them together. So that's. Basically, the pattern for the plucking. And for the G, I just pluck the top E string along with three random strings. Pluck it all at the same time. Now I'm going to teach you guys the chorus and we're going to add one more chord to this, which is the C chord. Um, basically your pointer finger is on the 1st fret on the 2nd B string. The middle finger is on the 2nd fret on the 4th D string. And ring finger is on the 3rd fret, the 5th A string. So the chords are played similar to the verses at first. So that's D sharp and B flat play it three times up to the G up to the G chord and then D sharp again and C D sharp F and back to D sharp this is when I started to strum it Sing for you. and B flat D sharp, F, and B flat again. For the strumming pattern, it's down, down, up, up, down, down, up, down. Sing for you. For the second verse, I basically plucked it the same way, and the second chorus, I just strummed it. And so now I'll teach you guys the bridge, and it's still the same chords. And I plucked it at first. By the way, sorry, I forgot the lyrics, so I just had to hum it. And for that last part that I just did. You basically pl pluck the root note and then each of the strings below that. And then the bottom E string, your pinky is going to be in the 5th fret. And let go to that, to this note. And then D sharp again, B flat, and then play D sharp and C twice. D 
sharp and F. Go back to the chorus. The way you smile. And so basically, yeah, it ends with the chorus. And that's the whole song. So hopefully this tutorial was useful for you and you were able to learn from it. I hope it's not too complicating. Please like, comment, and subscribe. And thanks for watching.